and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Pamela and I put out a couple beauty reviews every now and then. Today's review is going to be on um, some of the most hyped, uh, talked about brand I think at the moment, uh, which is ColourPop since they just launched. Like, spring and summertime like colors and I thought I love the idea of all of that however those are not necessarily shades that I am going to like for myself so I did a little bit of research I spent like a couple of days like looking at their websites I watched videos on swatches on their super shock shadows and um, some of their lippy and ultra satin formula liquid lipsticks uh, my friend Marta recommended the ultra um, satin lip so I went ahead and purchased one I purchased the color cozy because it's a beautiful orange red and that's exactly how it's described on the website and right now this is like one of my favorite colors to wear especially for like spring and summer I may even just wear it in the fall and winter too because it just looks so pretty on my complexion that I love using these colors I felt like the application for this one was very smooth I didn't have to redip my wand back into the bottle and it went on like like butter like it was so creamy and it was surprisingly very comfortable and it sort of left a little bit of a lip stain so throughout the day it wore down nicely the next like one that I purchased is this one here it's Aquarius and I'm pretty sure this is the Kathleen lights uh, collab that they did and if you don't know who Kathleen lights is shame on you you should go check out her channel she has wonderful videos and wonderful reviews and this color was gorgeous on me it wasn't a nude and it wasn't it brown it was more of a your lips but better color and I could just see myself wearing this one like every single day I definitely recommend picking this one up and the best part about it is it it literally smells like salted caramel and I love anything salted caramel and then the one that I am wearing for you right now is this beautiful also Kathleen lights collab color called Taurus Taurus I don't know how to really say that, but I'll have everything down there in the description bar for you. And I just like was drawn to this because I've never worn brown lipstick before, but this color is awesome. Like again, it glides on super smooth. This is a more matte formula versus Aquarius, which is a cream formula. So the cream ones I'm assuming are going to be a little more glossy versus, you know, this one, which is going to be matte. But on camera, it still looks a little bit glossy, which I don't mind because I overall think that this color is beautiful. Since it was only $5, I figured why not? you know be a little bit risky okay and then as far as the super shock eyeshadows I purchased this little quad here it is the peachy keen and the reason why I purchased this and not their new line is because I wanted to basically just try these like I didn't want to try any pressed shadows because I have plenty of those and um, again my friend Marta had told me that she did not recommend the pressed eyeshadows so I figured well I'm just trying this stuff out and this was perfect this came with three mattes and one shimmer and all of these colors are right up my alley I love anything warm and neutral and it just compliments me very well so I started out with brushes and it completely failed and I just got a little bit disappointed and a little bit like discouraged in them so I thought mm, okay let's just try it out a little bit more and see what happens and so then I just started using my fingers and for today's look I literally used every single color in this little quad or whatever and I used my fingers for all of it there was just some circumstances where I used um, sort of a fluffy brush to see if they would blend out and they just blended in together with one another amazingly like I've never seen something so creamy or so gel like blend in together so well and the, like I said I have all four of them on I think they look amazing the shades that come in this quad are Kennedy Cornelius bandit and crimper and what I did was I started with Kennedy and I took Kennedy and I, I put it on my ring finger and I sort of just stamped it into my crease and I basically stamped it all over my eye to be honest I wasn't careful I wasn't trying to be at all I just wanted to see like what would happen if I just used my fingers and pressed in all the eyeshadows versus using the brushes since I was having such a hard time then I went in with Cornelius and did exactly the same thing I pushed it into my crease a little bit just a little bit under Kennedy and then I blended it out onto my lid mostly concentrating um, towards the edge of my eye moving inward and I did that a couple times with this color and I moved on to bandit and bandit was this like 
super beautiful like brown red almost like a red brown brown red brownish red something like that and it it looks darker in the pot but as soon as I stamped it I was like oh okay that's really nice not as crazy dark as I thought and again it blended into Kennedy and Cornelius beautifully and I had a little bit of a problem at one point it did transfer to the bottom part of my basically like lid slash cheek, um, but I kind of just wiped it away a little bit and then it removed it. So it was pretty easy to, um, you know, come off of my skin, which I thought was even better for like beginners because I, you know, if you're using your fingers to blend certain eyeshadows and then make mistakes and just wipe them off. So they're almost like dummy proof, which I thought was fantastic again. So then I used crimper for the top of my lid and this is a like the most amazing, <laughs> the most amazing glitter like shadow because it's literally called an ultra glitter and I when I first saw it I was very skeptical because I saw chunks of glitter in it and I thought I don't do glitter for me personally I don't like much glitter on my eyes I don't think it looks really pretty on me to be honest so I was very scared to use it and then as soon as I stamped it I noticed it was it wasn't like any sort of glitter e eyeshadow that I've ever used. It was so finely milled but cream textured that it just looked like glistening. Like it was such a subtle like glisten or glow on my eyelid that I just like loved it. And the best part about it is it layered really well. I put on like sort of one layer and then I went back in and put a little bit more to build up the pigmentation. I'm looking for something easy and fast, I'm definitely recommend these. It had shadows that I knew that I was going to wear, so that's the only reason why I went with this one and nothing new or overhyped that they have on their website. As far as prices, you know, it wasn't so bad. Little Quad Alone was $18. Um, the lippy sticks were $5, which I thought was great. I could see myself purchasing a couple of those later on in different shades. And then the Ultra Satin Liquid Lip um, was $6, so not bad for $30. Um, shipping was free if you paid over $30. If you purchase these individually, I believe they're $5, so everything is for the most part very affordable. Um, since it was my first time ordering, obviously I did spend a lot more, but um, that's what I'm here for, to recommend to you what you should and should not buy. So in the end, the only ones I super highly recommend and I guess if you are looking for recommendations is the shade crimper like I said all over the lid looks beautiful you could probably even try and use this as a highlighter um, Aquarius which is a perfect everyday like sort of your lips but better color and then this super awesome um, brown lippy stick in Taurus Taurus that and that's basically all that I have for you guys today so hopefully you enjoyed my little mini review slash demo on my little ColourPop haul. Um, overall, I'm very happy with what I purchased and I could see myself using these multiple, multiple times. So if you liked my video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for future posts, and spread my love for makeup. Bye-bye!